Hello and welcome to Glasgow, where the 20th Commonwealth Games began in spectacular fashion. Scottish icons known throughout the world joined local dancers and performers in the opening ceremony at Celtic Park to provide a stunning curtain raiser. Ladies and gentlemen, you know, there's an amazing continuity to the Commonwealth Games, which were first held in Hamilton, Canada in 1930. In celebration of that continuity, we're now going to acknowledge the flag of India, who were hosts four years ago for the Delhi Games, the flag of Scotland as host of Glasgow 2014, and the flag of Australia, who will host the 21st Commonwealth Games in Gold Coast four years from now. Very soon, we're going to be welcoming the head of the Commonwealth, Her Majesty the Queen, to Glasgow. And to personally greet her on our behalf, please welcome His Royal Highness, Prince Imran, President of the Commonwealth Games Federation. Michael Kavanagh, Chairman of Commonwealth Games Scotland. And Lord Smith of Kelvin, who is Chairman of the Glasgow 2014 Organising Committee. Welcome the pipes and drums of the Scottish regiments, accompanied by representatives from the Braemar Royal Highland Gathering. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the head of the Commonwealth, Her Majesty the Queen, accompanied by His Royal Highness, the Duke of Edinburgh. And we're expecting the red arrows any minute to fly over Celtic Park is never most exciting when they appear, John. Incredible. Hawk Jets, it's their 50th display season. Nine pilots, they've all had frontline experience, and when they come over, watch. It's blue and white smoke, symbolising these Glasgow 2014 Commonwealth Games. Well, that was the Scottish singer Susan Boyle singing there, and then the Molly Pintar, undiscovered of course, before appearing in the TV show Britain's Got Talent, and she was accompanied on piano by Katie Aitchison. Here's a queen arriving now, and in front of her, some representatives from the world famous Braemar Gathering, which is attended every year without fail by the queen as patron, held in the beautiful Cairngorms National Park and close to her Scottish home, Balmoral. She is getting an incredible reaction here from this Glasgow crowd in Parkhead. Come for the first fully integrated, able-bodied and para games, 21 approved sports. And Her Majesty there shaking the hand of Michael Kavanagh. And we should of course give a mention to the amazing pipes and drums of the Scottish Regiment. Never anything less than stirring visually and musically, or is that just the Scot in me, John? 
No, it's great. And um, there is something about the tartan and the pipes and drums, and there's a girl giving a posy to the Queen. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the Braemar Gathering Party, led by Robert Lovey, invite you to join us in the singing. Please be upstanding for the national anthem. God save our gracious Queen, long live our noble Queen, God save the Queen. Say 